All right, it's the Brooke with That Gratitude Guy. Just write in your gratitude journal on the days that you want to feel good. People ask me a lot. They say, well, you know, I'm, I've got this gratitude journal. I'm trying to write in it. I write, I write in it a few days a week. I write in every other day, whatever. I always encourage people, that's great. Just get started. If you're writing in it once a day, once a week, once a month. But you know what? Get started because what you're going to notice when I mention just write in your gratitude journal on the days you want to feel good, you will feel much better. So if you start out a few days a week and then uh, five or six times a week and eventually every single day like I do and a lot of people do, you'll notice a huge shift in your mindset. Your whole mindset is going to be more positive. It reframes and refocuses that, that attitude and that view towards life so much more. I think many, many times about it's like building a muscle. You don't go to the gym on the first of the month and work out and it's good for all 30 days. But if you do a half hour every single day, by the end of the month, you're going to have a tremendous amount of, uh, of muscle tone and you're going to be in a lot better shape. It's also something else I've mentioned. We could all go walk a mile every single day. It wouldn't be that hard to walk down a half mile and, come and, and walk back. But could we walk 365 miles on uh, December 31st and call it good for the year? So think about with that journal, it just takes seven to eight minutes a day, but really more than anything else, just write in that journal, write in that gratitude journal on the days you want to feel good because you will, will feel much better. That's the message for today. If you don't have a gratitude journal, you can pick one up at thebrooker.com. It makes a huge, huge difference. Have a great day. We'll see you tomorrow. Bye-bye.